This is KTBC TV, Channel 7, Austin. From Austin's News Channel, this is the Channel 7 News 6 o'clock report with David Swafford and Linda Schaefer, Mike Chilinas with weather, and Mark Covey on sports. Well, coming up later, we'll tell you about a man who gave up his career to follow a dream. And up next, bigger sometimes is better, but it can also be confusing, especially when it comes to the UT Library. Bread. Finding material in a library should be fairly easy by the time you get to college. That is, of course, unless you go to the University of Texas. Channel 7 Steve Rambo says the Austin campus sports the biggest academic library in the state. And that can mean headaches if you don't know how to use it. Walk in here and right away you're struck by the size of this place. Look at this card catalog. Inside these files are the call numbers for almost 1.8 million books. This building has six floors of open stacks just like these. Place those stacks end to end and the line would stretch from Austin to San Antonio. This place, in a word, is awesome. Uh, yes, it does seem frightening, but it's not a system designed to thwart people. It is a system designed to help them locate what they want. And I think that, as I said, once they begin to know how to do it, some of that mystery and frightening aspect begins to fade away. And they feel but to help the mystery fade quickly, tours are offered by library staff during the first couple of weeks of the new semester. Nothing big, just a walkthrough to acquaint students with the physical layout and services offered here. Gaines says many students who take the tour come from small towns and haven't had the opportunity to use a library even close to this size. But there is another reason. Taking this tour is like protecting the investment these students are making in their education. After all, this place here is the best information resource on campus, but you have to know it to use it. Steve Rambo, Channel 7 News. Hi.